Hey guys, it's Gwyneth. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'll be showing you guys my get ready with me for my first day of school. It's the fall semester. So it's actually my last semester. I graduate with my associate's degree. And I'm probably going to get my bachelor degrees, bachelor degrees, bachelor degree right after. It's been a hot minute since I recorded. I haven't recorded a video besides the last video before this one in a whole month. The entire summer I've been working or going out to like hang out with my family and my boyfriend um, and going to the gym basically and so I haven't really had time to record. I haven't recorded a tutorial get ready with me um, in a whole month. So I'm gonna try to be as consistent as possible for you guys. I'm trying. I really haven't been inspired or anything so if you guys want to see anything that you have in mind leave it down below so yeah if you guys want to see how I get ready for my first day of school then please keep watching <laughs> for this look I really want it to be lightweight but also glam and looking cute I'm not usually like that for the first day of school but it's first day of school gotta look cute all the makeup products that I use in this video are all drugstore and affordable so yeah let's get to it the first part I'm going to use is the Nivea Men Plus Shea Balm. You can find this in the men's shaving section in your drugstore and it will make your makeup last all day. The next primer I'm going to use is the e.l.f. Poreless Face Primer. This will just release all your pores. I usually put it on my T-zone and it's a good dupe for the Dr. Brandt Pores No More Primer. Now for my eyebrows, I'm going to use this NYX Brow Pomade and I'm in the color Espresso which is uh, kind of a dupe to the Ebony Anastasia one which is the one that I usually use and I'll put the link to my eyebrow tutorial up on the right. Let me know if you guys want an updated eyebrow tutorial. It's an okay dupe for the Anastasia one, but it turned a little bit more brown over the day. Now I'm just gonna use the Maybelline Fit Me concealer just to clean it up. I'm gonna use the Fit Me Stick Foundation, which isn't the same color as the liquid foundation that I use. I'm usually in the shade 228, but this is 245. It's close, so I'm gonna use it to clean the top of my brow, which I usually like to do. Now I'm going to use this clear eyebrow gel from e.l.f. which I really like just to brush my eyebrow hairs up. Now I'm going to apply the stick foundation all over my face and I'm just going to buff it in. Just to cover up any blemishes or pimples, I'm going to use the same Maybelline concealer. I'm going to be using the NYX concealer just to conceal my under eyes and it's one of my favorite drugstore concealers. I'm going to apply this NYX setting spray just to lock in all the oils before I apply powder. I'm gonna apply the Maybelline Fit Me Powder Foundation in the shade 220. It's just a couple shades lighter than me and I'm gonna set all my concealer. I'm gonna set the rest of my face with the same powder foundation but in the shade 235. They don't have the same color as the foundation stick. And then I'm gonna use this e.l.f. Blush and Bronzer Duo. I'm just gonna use the bronzer which I've had since high school. And it's really pigmented and it has a tiny bit of shimmer if you don't like shimmer. And then to contour my face, I'm going to use the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer, which I normally use to bronze my face when I'm a little bit more lighter, but I'm just going to use it to contour. Since I didn't use any loose powders today, I'm just going to use the powder foundation just to clean up the contour and bronzer. I like to use the brush that I set my concealer with just to blend out the edges. And then for highlighter, I'm using the Milani highlighter in the shade Day Glow, which is a pretty champagne color. I'm 
And for blush, I'm using the Milani Luminoso blush, which is my favorite. I think it's hands down the best blush from the drugstore. I'm gonna curl my lashes and apply mascara before I apply falsies. And for mascara, I'm using my favorite, which is the Maybelline Lash Sensational. I use it in the waterproof version. For lashes, I'm gonna be using the Ardell Soft Touch Lashes in the style 161 and the Duo Brush On Adhesive. I'm gonna line my lips with the Essence Lip Liner in the shade Soft Berry. And then I'm going to be using this NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick in the shade Soft Spoken. I'm going to be using this Physician's Formula Liquid Eyeliner just to line the upper rim of my lash line. And then I'm going to be using this Wet n Wild Setting Spray to make my makeup last all day. For my hair, I'm going to be using the new Me 25mm Curling Wand from their Lustrum set. And then I'm going to be using the Tresemme Heat Teamer to protect my hair while the curling iron heats up. Before I curl my hair, I'm actually going to spray it with some hairspray. I'm using the L'Oreal one. I'm going to start with the longest layer of my hair. I'm just going to split it into sections and I'm going to curl the curls away from my face, leaving off two inches at the end and leaving it on for 10 seconds. It's going to be just like beachy waves. The curls are not even an inch in width, but once I get to the front of my face, I'm just going to make them a little bit smaller. After I'm done curling my hair, I'm actually going to take some random pieces and curl them towards my face just to add some volume. After applying hairspray to my hair, I'm just going to use this dry bar dry shampoo just to add some texture to my hair. Since this is beachy waves, I'm just going to mess it around a little bit. And to style my hair, I'm just going to take an inch of my hair and just twist it and tie it off with a rubber elastic. I'm just going to change into my outfit for my top. I'm wearing Charlotte Russe. The denim joggers are from Paxson and the slides are from Forever 21. Whenever I wear a shirt like this, I like to highlight my shoulders and my collarbone, and I'm just going to be using the same highlighter. And I always apply perfume, so I'm going to be using this Selena Gomez perfume, which is my favorite. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this first day of school Get Ready With Me. I hope you guys have a great semester and a great school year. Leave a comment down below if you guys want to see any more back to school videos. Leave me a suggestion. And don't forget to like this video and subscribe if you guys haven't already. And until next time, I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!